it's time to talk with the master Frank Daimel. Yes, sure. selection of uh, Daimler Double Star uh, in a patched top version and uh, also with our new uh, Plexi Top pickups. It's you know, basically T90 pickups uh, with the uh, nice frost, frost color and uh, we have a new mounting system on them as well. They are mounted from the back wow. so you have to um, do the heat adjustment from this side and, and or here inside for the bridge pickup. And yes, we are mixing the classic uh, ingredients like the arch top and the mahogany set neck type of guitar with uh, pop art or modern uh, elements. This is what uh, the goal was by this guitar. Very nice. Second one. And then we have a collaboration from uh, me and my wife Cora. She's doing uh, the Firestar, which is our most sold model and uh, she's doing her artwork she, she applies the artwork to the guitar and uh, this is a special technique where you can go around the entire body and uh, actually do whatever you like to put on the surface and I'm varnishing the guitar and the, the artwork and the fretboard is especially noticeable here you have a whole story of the recent uh, demonstrations of uh, our social culture. <laughs> and then as well we have the um, pickup Leslie inside here. This is a sear cut which lets rotate uh, or alternate the pickups electronically. So once you switch it on you can adjust the speed here. Switch it on here, adjust the speed. It goes from very slow to very very high speed. And uh, yeah, this resembles of a Leslie effect almost. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Very nice. It's the artist edition. A lot of work. A lot of work, <laughs> yeah. The third one. The third one is the uh, Firestar Le uh, Ellipse, called Ellipse, because yeah, it has the ellipt elliptical shape of a big art. And uh, well, normally we are doing this kind of model, which is the classic Firestar in a traditional style. The idea was to mix uh, the non-reverse firework with the Jazzmaster Jaguar style and uh, yeah, to keep the, the 60s vibe in the guitar, but uh, this is the new approach to get a bit away from the classical parallel shapes of the pickguard to make a new element into it and uh, I think we have a very nice finish here. This is a semi-gloss, semi-transparent metallic. What kind of wood? It's swamp ash, one swamp piece ash. swamp ash. And uh, we also have the elliptical shapes as uh, covers for the electronics on the back side. And we have a beautiful maple neck, maple neck figure, yeah. maple neck one piece. And uh, it's a long scale guitar. Is the, the wood from Germany and United States? Excuse me? The, the wood is from US and Germany? Or the, the, the wood? The wood is coming from the US, of course, uh -huh. and, uh, as well uh, the neck. This is a Canadian uh, hard rock okay. maple neck, and this is uh, the Southern Swamp Ash. This is American woods. Yeah. Yes. And then we have um, this is a German hardware. It's coming from Berlin, ABM, and we are connect. Uh, we are combining it with the T tune saddles from Hamburg, and the pickups are self-made. We we do them ourselves. And in this way, it's uh, this kind of guitar. We have a tap version here. We have, can tap the neck pickup and we can tap the bridge pickup. And you have the uh, a kill switch here. And we do all kinds of switches on these sections here, whatever you want to on a custom order. Good. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Frank, see you. Yes, yeah, see you on guitarschange.com. Bye bye. Ciao.